Hey guys, I'm back with a new video. This time, I'll be doing a beginner eyebrow tutorial. So this is going to be my first time doing a tutorial. So if, if it's not going to be great, then that's good because it's going to help me practice too. I mean, I've been doing makeup since I was in high school. So I'm not a pro. I'm not saying I'm a pro, but um, I'm getting there. So just bear with me and thumbs up and then subscribe. So first, you would just, you know, brush off your hair or your eyebrow. You don't want all of those, um, you know like your hair when you hair when your eyebrow hair are standing you know like the other one is hanging down here the other one is pointing up yeah you don't want those because that's gonna be that's gonna be like weird you know like I don't like it <laughs> so this tutorial I'll be using my Anastasia Brow Powder Duo. So I don't have their pencil because I'm not really, I'm not saying it's bad, but I'm just not so used to drawing a pen, like lining it up, you know, like, I don't know. For me, my eyebrows are great. So I'll be using the shade Brunette or they call it dark brown so now it comes like this and then the inside is like the two color I'll be you can tell I'll be using this a lot because you can see those marks so that's that's the thing I'll be using to sh shade my or to outline my eyebrow and then I'll be using this I don't have an expensive brushes so I just go to the drugstore and buy you know brushes that are cheap because you know I'm still learning on how to do tutorials and makeup for me it's not how much you spend or the what equipment or tools you're using it's for me it's whatever suits me so it's whatever you guys think that works is great like you don't have to buy those I'm not saying that you should not but you sh it's okay to use long you know those drugstore brushes because they're great too like as long as they work for you so I'll be using this QVC brush so it's angled so it looks like this so this is my favorite um, eyebrow brush this is that'll be what I'll be using every so, time the stuff that I'll be using are my favorite, favorite duo of all. Even though it's expensive, I'm not so sure how much it's cost, but I think now it's like $30 or up. I'm not so sure how much, but it depends. So I'll be using Anastasia um, Brow Duo. So this is how it looks like and then the inside are my shades so I'm using brunette or dark brown so those are the two that the lady at Sephora recommended to me that are my eye you know my eyebrow color so yeah next I'll be using this drugstore eyebrow brush I mean you don't for me I don't have like those really expensive brushes that are that are um you know Sephora has or um, Mac has because for me I'm not I don't have that much money to buy you know you know how expensive they are so I'm slowly getting those brushes though like individually but if they are on sale 
I would for sure grab it because you know it's on sale. So, but this thing is really great. Like, I bought it at I guess Walmart for I would say ten dollars. I'm not so sure, but it's a QVC eyebrow angled brush. So this is how it looks like from afar, and then it angled. So I have been using this like over three years now so it works really great so and I have this um Sephora angled liner Sephora I know it's really tiny but it's a Sephora angled brush it's for eyeliner so I haven't been using this I use it to um do my highlighting and stuff on after I do my eyebrows and then I'll be using this for uh, this brow fix I know it's kind of it's kind of blurry but it looks like this it's it's um I would say a glue like it's the thing you put before you put the shades you'll see it <laughs> And then I'll be finishing it with my the Pixi the Pixi Natural Brow Duo. I'm on Deep Brunette. You can tell I've been using it a lot, but it looks like this. It's an angled um, pencil. So that's how it looks like. And I'm not gonna be using this pencil because um, you can tell I'm running out. I'm running out. <laughs> So it's really expensive, like it's like $16, $16, dollars $16 at Target. But for me, I buy it because it's my all-time all time favorite. Because it's easy, you can just, you know, put it, you don't have to do the shading stuff. But if you don't have this, I recommend to buy, I recommend you buy Anastasia Brow Duo. And then I'll be finishing it with this um, gel looking thing inside of it. I'm only using this because I don't have the the after gel to put Okay, after. so so first you'll be using this the brow fix to just you know I don't know I like doing this for a reason because you can you can tell that my, this brow the arch the arch is higher than this brow so I won't focus in this one first. I won't focus in this one because this thing is just easy because you know I already have the arch this thing I have to work on it really hard so just bear with me so first you have to just Can you see it? The, the hair are like, like down because of the glue. So, so I'll be using the darker shade of the no, this. I'll be using the shade.
so this when you start when you're already on this side you have to just you know lightly put the shade because you don't want this part to be way too dark So you can see it compared to the the other side. It's it's more you know more arch, I think. I'm not really good at making arches really high. So I'll just I just do whatever. So next side you just me yeah, I just I don't put the glue all the way because I don't know why it's the other side is always thicker than the left side, but I hate it. <laughs> I would say the left side is the hardest thing, the hardest side to do because. It's like something it goes crooked and like I don't know how the heck or what what the heck I'm in, um what the heck I'm doing I stretch I do this because the hair I want it to This side, I notice that this side always comes out darker, so I just put it's whatever you feel, you just put you know, you just compare and then put shades on this side if your side or your if your if this side is lighter than this side or vice versa sometimes I can re literally perfect this thing but I think it's because it's night time here in Hawaii so and I just finished work do is you if you have this if you have the I know their Anastasia have um, this gel that they have it's a there's a clear or like darker darker um, color gel so if you have this or the Anastasia one this gel you'll be using it right after you apply the shade so you don't really need like a thick gel you just like you know like just rub the excess and then
And what I like about this, what I like is it's waterproof. So you can go swimming with your eyebrows. You can sweat with your eyebrows still on fleek, you know. So that's the only thing I like about it. And then for me, I just grabbed this. Um, I'm using Fit Me Maybelline Maybelline 315 shade foundation. You can use whatever foundation you have in your um in your closet or in your room. So um, they said to you don't really need like and like expensive highlighting after a highlighter after your um you do your eyebrow so for me it's my daily foundation that i'll be using because they said that if you 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 have to use a, a um a highlighting part that are your shade you know like so perfect you can use your foundation because it's your shade you know so i'm just putting it under here And on the top and then you don't you don't have you, you cannot I mean not cannot but you don't really like wipe it like you know like you're wiping it you just dab it because you want it to to look perfect sorry if you can hear background noise that's my grandma in her bathroom because <laughs> literally my room is right next to her bathroom or yeah so can you see the difference it's like if you have a like you can use a blending brush too like but I always I really like to use my finger because you can you don't you don't touch this area, only this area. So you can tell, can you see the difference from this side on this side? So. So I recommend this tutorial for like beginners because um, I'm a beginner myself, so if you're, if you don't have, like, a really nice shaped brow, you can just do this makeup. Because me, I'm really, I'm really, um, insecure with myself, so when I see girls that I have really nice eyebrows like I always say oh I wish I have what I have her eyebrows it's so pretty like how does she do it but then you know you don't want to be like you don't want to be her you want to be yourself so there so that's it that's for me sometimes eyebrows are really time consuming so if you wanna do it like a 15 minute eyebrow um i would just say just do this but then take out the the highlighting part i mean you look good even though it's not highlighted still so, yeah. hi so if you found this tutorial really helpful especially to you beginners I would hit thumbs up, subscribe on my channel so you can watch me do some tutorials. If you comment, comment whatever you want. Bashers, I don't care. If you want to say I'm ugly, go ahead. I'm fat, go ahead. I don't care. Please, 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 I recommend you guys to comment me what you want me to do next. Because I would really want you guys to enjoy and watch me do stuff every day you know I'm really I get bored all the time so if you want me just let me know on comments below and yes yeah, so
so oh all of the all of the tools that I had or that I've been using to do my eyebrows on this tutorial I'll have the link below and so you can check out the description you can compare prices you can do um you can just check it out so you, you know you can just use it and then if anything I hope you guys have a good weekend here in Hawaii right now it's 8 38 p.m. so if you are two hours three hours ahead have a great weekend and happy Friday everyone Aloha